What's up y'all, Tyler Devereaux here. Listen, some of y'all have seen some of my YouTube videos on our multifamily mindset events, but you might not know what it's like or what, you know, what happens when you're there. So I'm gonna give you a little sneak peek behind the scenes so you know what to expect. So follow me this way. Come to the hotel, we're walking through the doors. We usually have this sign set up so you know where to go. Just a little ease of use. Right, guide and direct you. And then one of the first people you're gonna meet is this young lady right here. Her name is Noel. Noel runs the show. Noel, everything happens and goes as planned because of Noel right here. First person you'll meet right here should be y'all checked in, all registered to have your name tags ready. And then we'll head into the room. Anything else specific that you can know, Noel? Nope, that's it. I'm ready. I'm ready to learn. I'm excited. And with a smile. No, and with a smile. Come with a smile, okay? <laughs> now we're coming this way. Once you know, well, get you registered, get your name tag. Come in, we'll meet Mark Pitts. Mark Pitts will help us get a seat okay. here. Go ahead, I'll follow Come you, on. man. Let's go. Right. Just the room. You got the setup here. You got the team back here. Everyone on the team. Give him a good smile and a good shock. Let's see what you yeah. got. <laughs> we, need, we still need to work on their shock. I don't know. Bunch of howlies back here. In the setup, we'll get you a seat. And later, I'll give you a tip on how to hustle Jed for a front row seat, okay? We'll go through, through that later, I promise you. All right, peace. <laughs> right, welcome to the multifamily mindset. Day one. Day one's fun, man. I'll tell you my favorite part of day one is just getting to meet everybody. We have close to 100 people that are coming in today and to get to meet each and every one of them and hear a little bit about their story, their goals, is amazing to me. I love that human element. Today we cover a lot though. So one of the most impactful po points that we go through is we go through the multifamily acquisitions process from A to Z on like this 60,000 foot level, right? Before we dive in deep to every single intricate detail, it's important for them to see this snapshot of like what's gonna be covered and how the process goes so they can wrap their mind around it. And then we dive into it. We also cover our you know, value add opportunities. That's how we drive value up on a deal. Uh, NOI boosting opportunities, value add opportunities, creative ways to do that. And then also our first underwriting example. We have to do a case study where we take a deal, we run the numbers, we see if it's a, if it's a good deal or not. And then we can kind of gauge from there. So today is this foundational day of understanding multifamily acquisition process, how it works, and then day two we dive in even deeper on all those nitty gritty details. So stay tuned as we get through, but you'll love day one. All right, welcome to day two, Saturday usually. I I love day two, love day two, because here's the thing, day one, day one's probably my hardest day to get through. There's a lot of content, but it's this foundational content, right? It's starting to seep in, but day two, this is when it starts to really start to sink in for them. Like we start out by underwriting income and expenses on bigger properties, helping them understand how we look at those operational history, like looking at the numbers, how to spot a good deal. That's absolutely critical in the multifamily space. So that's how we begin the day. Underwriting, income, expenses, operating history, a bunch in that, tons of content in that, in that area. And you start to just see a click in their mind. Then we break off and we do a case study. And the case studies are great because everyone learns differently, right? Some people learn visually, audibly, but most people like really learn and retain by doing it. So we break them off into small groups and they underwrite a deal, like a real deal. And it's a 138 unit deal, and they try to spot good things, bad things, and it's so fun, it's one of our, our deals, obviously, that we've closed, and it's so fun to see them underwrite that and see those things, and as they notice them, they start to realize how much they're learning. That's fun. Then we go to lunch, right? 
Come back from lunch, we dive into emerging markets, like how to identify a market, how to choose a market, and then we get into raising capital. And raising capital is, it's my biggest strength. It used to be my biggest mental stumbling block, my biggest weakness, it's my biggest strength in this business. So walking them through how to raise funds, which I'm gonna tell you all of them, 99.9% .9 of them are terrified to raise funds. You can see it in their face, I know they are. Even if they say they are, they are. I know it. So to walk them through strategies and systems on how to actually raise funds and see them understand like there's a strategy behind it, a system behind it, which eliminates the fear, it's very, very, very fun. Okay, that's day two. My, one of my favorite days, but tomorrow, you're gonna see this tomorrow. Tomorrow is where everything starts to come full circle. Tonight, everyone leaves and they know, they know they can do it. But tomorrow, where everything comes full circle. But shit, let's focus on today, dude. And today, love Saturday. Let's dive in. What's up, y'all? It is Sunday, day three. And as you can tell, I'm not at the event. We're at the airport. Listen, today, it was amazing first off, but man, things just got crazy busy. I wasn't able to, to record at the very beginning, but let me tell you what happened today. First off, let me tell you what we teach today. Sunday is the most information packed day of all of them. Uh, we start out with finding deals. So we go through, we talk about how to find deals, how to build relationships with brokers, how to have that initial broker script, and go through that broker script to uh, find commonality, build uh, status alignment, credibility with brokers, uh, how to set up your direct mail campaigns, all sorts of creative ways to get deals. And then we lead into uh, how to submit offers on those deals, different loan structures and how we go about that. And then uh, dialing into uh, what, probably one of my favorite sessions of the whole weekend, which is financial and physical due diligence. Just so much content there, tons of content to go through, uh, which is just a lot. Then we go to lunch, we came back, and we cover property packing. One of my biggest strengths in this big business is raising funds and strategically designing the, the business plan to be able to present to investors. And that's always a fun part for me because walking them through the business business plan, property packet, same thing. It's, it's what we send to investors to um, show them about the deals for them to invest in. And walking through that and seeing it click in everyone's mind and helping like that you can see that they're starting to grasp that there's systems and processes and how you go about it and they're starting to understand how you go about it and they're asking questions and they're starting to realize how much they've learned all weekend and uh, that's why I end with that because it's twofold they learn a bunch but they also realize all the stuff that I'm going through they realize once again how much time and effort they've put in and how much they've learned how much progress they've made and that is the funnest part for me it's starting to see it's it's so fun to see the full transition from Friday to Sunday. Friday they come in, they're excited, but they're also a little bit on guard and you know, they don't, the belief, that the belief isn't fully there that they can do this business. But by Sunday, the belief is fully there and it goes from, you know, this energy that is, un, you know, this unknown energy, this kind of anxiety a little bit, to on Sunday there's energy no, no anxiety, it's just energy. It's their belief system has changed completely. And that's an amazing thing, man. The most rewarding part about the events is that right there. And then getting everybody hugs at the end. And now, now we're at the airport, rushed, almost missing our flight, but we got here in time. And uh, flying back out now to, you know, to go do some more work. Gonna go, gonna go tour some properties. And just grateful to be in a position to do that. An amazing event to all y'all in Cincinnati who are watching this, who are at that event. I love y'all. Very grateful for the time and the effort and the love that you showed towards me. Y'all were so very complimentary and nice. I appreciate it a ton. Thank you so much. Can't wait to keep in contact.